Hey, thanks. Thank you. We owe you everything. Seriously, man. Without you, we would have got reverse swept out of the building. Thankfully, we had Markel Fultz plus money. First quarter hit. Because the rest of the night was as shaky as my left hand holding this mic. It was a fucking disaster last night. Holy shit. We go one and four. I had to double check that. Markel Fultz is the only thing that hit. What? I'm lucky to be here right now. I mean, I could ask you to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe, but you're probably like, why? You just told me that you suck. And I do suck. Every now and again, I don't suck. And that's when it's fun. And that's when you want to be behind us. Look, every, every, every now and again, we have that. And I, I just, we have to acknowledge that it was not a fun night. Five bets in five minutes. You can thumbs up and subscribe us all day. We appreciate that. Let's begin. Start the clock right now. All right. Evan Mobley over 13 and a half points. That's where we begin. Donovan Mitchell is back. And there's going to be a lot of focus. Uh, look at that total, 211 and a half. Check the NBA parlay video out, by the way, as we dive a little deeper into the game. But with Donovan Mitchell back and people looking at a Darius Garland prop, here's Evan Mobley. I think that's just way too low. And if you want to look at the difference between Garland at 21 and a half or Mitchell at 24 and a half, the reality is that gap, that projected gap from Mobley to where he should finish is much wider for me than the other two guys. I'd argue than the other two guys combined. I think Garland and Mitchell's lines are pretty sharp overall, but we'll roll number one, first play of the day, over 13 and a half points for Evan Mobley. I don't know. I mean, maybe at 26 and a half or something along those lines, but we've been on the Jalen Brunson train for a long time now, and this is still not high enough for me. Still think that we can roll here over 24 and a half. The Knicks have a sense of desperation tonight. Again, we hit that. Check the NBA parlay video. In fact, if you check that video and roll, you got the Knicks at minus two and a half. It's now three. That's fine. Knicks need this game. Jalen Brunson is a rudder. Julius Randle can provide. RJ Barrett can provide. But there's volatility, there's inconsistency, there's struggle. I think Jalen Brunson is the easiest rudder to target now in this game. And at 24 and a half points, to get us 26, to get us 28, I mean, would you be surprised? I was tempted to push this as an alt play to 30, but we don't need that. 25 points is plenty for a guy who will take on dual role tonight. Double, double, your eyebrows should perk up at that shit as well. Second play on the board over 24 and a half points for Jalen Brunson. Let's move to the PRA. This is all three for Giannis. Now, we've got in the past, and we've been up and down with how we played Giannis before, but uh, at home against Charlotte should be a smash spot. The one area that I think helps us here, it's not rebounds and it's not points, but it's assists. The books have Giannis assists right now at four and a half. Over is minus 130. So there is a belief the less risk being taken by the book is to hit five assists. You give me six assists from Giannis, and this is a smash tonight. Absolute smash. He's going to get us 30 points. He's going to get us at least 13 rebounds, if not 14, 15 at most. That range I'm prepared for. You get me, I mean, think about that. You give me 13 rebounds, six assists, 14 rebounds, six assists. We're good. That's 1920 right there. 31, 32, 33, 34 in a blowout. Absolutely. Absolutely. You can be 32 points, 14 rebounds, six assists in a blowout where he's doing the majority of the work. We're in great shape. We're already past the prime here. Let's get to our fourth play. Uh, McCollum is back tonight. Brandon Ingram back tonight. They need to score. McCollum and company are going to get run out of the building here as Denver is back to the wall, desperate now, losing their second strain, all this other shit that's been piled up on this. No, no. For us, it's more about how does New Orleans stay in this basketball game? How does New Orleans get up in this game early? How does New Orleans establish any lead that may be blown? I get that. But McCollum has to be aggressive from three. 
and the Pelicans have to force that early on. They really do. I mean, look, Ingram's going to be out there. That's going to be fine. Herb Jones, you've got some guys up front. Maybe you can score a little bit or, or at least put some pressure. But this is going to be a McCollum special, and it has to be. The lone play that hit last night, the first quarter play. Let's get right back to it, shall we? Oh, Patrick Williams. Over three and a half first quarter points. Yeah, the Bulls. They have a tough matchup with Kawhi and Paul George, and especially defensively, Levine, DeMar, not even Vooch because he's just too shaded to the over there. This is a guy who could sneak in and do some work early and take some pressure off of Levine and DeRozan and to a lesser extent, Vucevic. And now all of a sudden, Patrick Williams gets six points in the first quarter and may finish with nine in the game, but We've hit because once again, it's a lesser target who has a better matchup that you can for force early. Vucevic is also a good candidate for this. I just didn't want to lay the 145. Five bets in five minutes. There you have it. We'll run it back. These are five bets, five games. There is a parlay option as well. I'll tell you all about that. But first, how about $5 into $200? This is the easiest thing you're going to do today. I mean, this is so simple here. All I need you to do is be in a state where you can legally gamble. Maybe it's a state that's brand new to legal sports betting. You want to take advantage of this. Here you are. Bet $5, win 200 in bonus bets. All you need to do is take 90 seconds out of your life. Be 21 or older. If you have a gambling problem, call 1-800-GAMBLER. There's a QR code. There's a link below. Either way, it's going to work for you. Either way. So click that link below. Use the QR code. Whatever you want. Deposit five and only five dollars. Once you do, put that five dollars right there. We've done it there for you. Okay, put that five dollars on Wake Forest plus eight and a half. Who cares if they win, they lose, they cover, they don't? It doesn't matter. As soon as you place the wager, two hundred dollars right back into your account. See, that easy, that simple. Over thirteen and a half Evan Mobley points. Over twenty four and a half points for Jalen Brunson. Over 51 and a half PRA for Giannis, over two and a half threes for McCollum, and over three and a half Patrick Williams first quarter points. Now, if you want to parlay that, plus 2246. You want more parlays? I got them in my Discord. There's a code for you below ES Insider. There's a link. Your first week is half off, 50% off using that code ES Insider. What's to lose there? You can sneak around, you can sniff around, you can say what's up, but we have parlays for days. NBA parlays, we're doing a lot. Not just this video, we do a bunch in the Discord. And we have some fun. We'll throw things around for you left and right. We even do some hockey. You never know what you'll find here. Hockey, hockey, hockey. By the way, speaking of the NBA... I want you to take advantage. We have parlays and crazy shit in my Discord channel for you because I know you love your parlays, but you also love solo plays and you want to win and you're a smart plus EV better. We have the Bet Pro tool for you on Stochastic. This is awesome. And you can sign up below. You're going to get a opportunity to take full advantage of this. We're all using this. We are all on site using the Bet Pro tool. Why? Not because we have some mandate up from the CEO, because this thing works, because we're making money off of it. All right. Because I've got parlay folks who are now using the Bet Pro tool for solo pro plays and they're building a bankroll that they can spend on the parlays for days. All works together for you. Plus 2246 if you choose. But I know you'll run these solo five and five. We do this six days a week and we'll see you. Thumbs up, subscribe, won't you?